Hello, I'm Amix Craven, and welcome to How to Zenotic. Today we're going to be going over the basic install for this game. First thing you're going to want to do is come over to zenotic.org and you're going to hit this massive download button. That will come up with a nice little zip file, which will take a little bit to download. The file is around 945 megabytes in size at the time of recording this video. So we're going to skip to when that has downloaded. Alright, so now that has downloaded, I've moved it into its own folder, and we're just going to simply extract that zip folder. It is just a normal zip folder, so you should be able to extract it very easily with any tool your computer comes with. Open up this folder, and you'll see all of this lot. The things you need to worry about are this one, zenotic.exe if you're on Windows, and either zenotic-linux glx if you're on Linux, or SDL, depending on which one you prefer to use. Use the either see which one works better for you and that is good there is a Mac version you will have to look at a small guide on how to get that set up because there is a bit of a problem with Apple tax but it is very easy to set up it's very well described in this forum thread anyone can do it and you can be playing Xenotic on whatever computer you want so I'm simply going to open up the GLX version of this game I'm going to run it and there we go, we have Xenotic running on the first install screen. I have another video that is out, and you should be able to see how to set up this game from this screen. So thank you very much for watching, I hope you've enjoyed this video, give it a like, and have fun in the game. Happy fragging!